What is going on everybody? Thank you so much for tuning in. My name is John. Today I have for you a convenience good. That's right, today we're going to be taking a look at the Aurora Nightlight LED Aurora Projector from SOAIY I picked up using Amazon Prime for $31.99. Out of 5 stars, this Projector Nightlight gets 4 out of 5 stars out of 4,120 customer reviews. Upstairs at night, it gets pretty dark in our sitting area. We have a couch and a TV. I think putting this in the corner to add a little bit of ambiance and a little bit of mood will definitely be a pretty nice upgrade. Uh, furthermore, maybe if you have a kid who has their own room, this would be really cool for them at night. So when they get up to use the bathroom or what have you, uh, they can see where they're going. So here we have the night light. It's a projector lamp. It is LED. Uh, if you actually look at the side of the box here, you get a pretty good idea of what comes in the box. Uh, what's actually really cool about this night lamp is it does have a built-in speaker to connect your phone to. Uh, one thing I want to point out about this night light is it is in white, but if you actually take a look at it on Amazon, it does come in black. So not sure if you have the option of picking black or white, but yeah, this is a really cool night lamp here. Uh, we're pretty much going to install this in our living room upstairs, which I think will be a really cool addition and add some ambiance. Uh, as you can see, like I said previously, you do get an included aux cable, so uh, you can just plug this right into your phone if it has a three and a half millimeter headphone jack. And second in the box, it's a little bit difficult to get out, is the night lamp itself all packaged up. And actually, one thing I want to point out is it is in black. So I was fooled by the box a little bit there. Uh, in the box here also is a wall adapter, which should basically work in tandem. It has a USB uh, port on the back. Uh, you can change the light pattern and it even has an Aurora effect. We'll go ahead and show you that once we get it set up. Uh, you can also control the volume of the speaker uh, if you're playing music out of it, which I really like. And then last but not least in the box, you do get uh, some user guides here uh, and what looks to be uh, a thank you card, probably with some warranty information on it. So be sure to check that out. And uh, if you just so happen to uh, want to learn a little bit more about how to use this to its fullest extent, you do get a pretty in-depth and pretty simple to understand user guide in the box. Uh, it's pretty wrapped up here in bubble wrap, which is nice. So it shouldn't be broken or anything. Uh, we'll just pull it out of its packaging here. Now it does have a removable dome. Uh, you do get some simple buttons at the bottom here. They're kind of mushy, they're clicky. Uh, there is a volume up button and a volume down button. Uh, this button in the middle here is to power it on and off and switch the lights manually should you uh, not be able to find the remote at night. Uh, I was actually kind of skeptical about what this night light would look like without the dome, but it actually looks pretty good without the dome. But if you, like I said, want to make the night light a little bit softer, you can add this dome on top. Uh, also, what I want to point out is there is room at the back for a three and a half millimeter aux cable. Uh, you shouldn't really be able to see these wires. Say if you set this up on a nightstand or a side table, uh, here is what the night light looks like with the dome on. As you can see, it definitely is a little bit softer because the dome is kind of a smoky, it has kind of a smoky tint to it. And then when you lift the dome off, which by the way is really easy to remove, uh, you do get full access to those LED lights. Uh, one thing I actually want to point out about this dome light is you kind of actually get this cool effect aside from the dome. So the dome is kind of like a pyramid. They're kind of uh, triangular. Uh, also, what I want to point out are there are little speakers here on the bottom of the dome. You get one on the right side here, uh, just on the right side. You don't get one on the left side. Uh, it's just one press to turn the light on. It is another press to change the color of the light or what will really come in handy 
is if you actually set this up with the remote. So uh, then that way you can turn it off and on on demand. So let's go ahead and turn it on here. And as you can see, the remote works flawlessly. Like I said, you can control that manually from the light itself. Let's go ahead and click that button again. And as you can see, it's taking us through all of the different effects that I showed you previously. If you actually take the dome off, you can see that the light itself is not rotating anymore, but you just press the rotate button and it rotates, which is really simple and really pretty cool. I think if you're going to use this as a night light, uh, you should definitely plug this into your phone and play soothing sounds off of it, like some rain or some crashing thunder or some rolling waves or maybe some birds chirping to help you get to sleep. I'm not sure that you would quite want to listen to music off this. Uh, it's not that great for listening to music on, but it is going to be great for listening to soothing sounds on, rolling waves, crashing thunder, rain hitting a tin roof, for example. I think this is perfect for that. Put it on a nightstand, uh, let it go, put it on a timer for an hour, two hours, four hours. Uh, another thing that I wanted to point out was uh, with the dome on, it's really not that bright. Uh, but with the dome off, it's extremely bright. Uh, when I was actually showing you that Aurora setting and all the other different light modes and the different brightness levels, that was with the dome off. But uh, I will say this, uh, if you do just want to have this as a night light uh, and you know not really have these bright obtrusive lights on your ceiling or on your wall while you're sleeping, uh, definitely have the dome on. It really softens things up a little bit. Uh, but it provides just enough light so that when you get up in the morning or in the middle of the night, uh, you can get a good idea of what you're looking at so that you're not tripping over yourself getting out of bed. But when I do have it set up in our living room, I am for sure going to use it without the dome because like I said, the dome just kind of softens it up too much uh, to the point where you don't actually get to see the effect. Uh, what I would like to see is a Bluetooth option so that you can connect this wirelessly. And last but not least, uh, I would actually like to see it change a few different colors. Uh, you kind of get blue, red, and green seem to be the three main colors. And yeah, did I say red? Blue, red, and green seem to be the three main colors here. I would like to see maybe purple. Uh, what's, what are some other colors? Yellow. This light projector lamp gets four out of five stars out of like 1,400 customer reviews. Gets a really solid rating. I really hope you enjoyed this unboxing and first impressions. If you want to see more content like this, hit that like button, subscribe. Once again, my name is John. Thank you so much for tuning in. I will see you in the next video.